It was their dream to sail around the world, but tonight a family from California is heading home. A couple and their two children had to be rescued after their one-year-old fell ill and their ship lost power. As Robin Stickley reports, even their own relatives say they had their doubts about the trip from the beginning. A high-risk mission above the Pacific Ocean. U.S. pararescue jumpers take one big step off the back of their plane, parachuting to the waters below. A complex and dangerous operation to bring a sick baby and her stranded family to safety. Thanks for watching our cool video. California couple Eric and Charlotte Kaufman say this was their dream. Seeing the world from their boat, the Rebel Heart. Their daughters, three-year-old Cora, and their toddler, one-year-old Lyra, on board. Which we're totally stoked. The family first set sail in 2012, blogging about the adventure along the way. Their youngest was born on the trip. They took a little break, then two weeks ago resumed the journey from San Diego, their sights set on New Zealand. But they hit serious trouble and rough waters, 1,600 kilometers off the coast of Mexico. Little Lyra was gravely ill with a rash, fever, and diarrhea. Making matters worse, the boat lost power and was drifting south. The boat had also lost its radios and its ability to, uh, to move. It was, unable, it was dead in the water. It's uh, a very um, empty part of the ocean that they were in that, uh, that made this difficult. California's National Guard responded to the Mayday call, facing a tricky mission and forced to refuel midair. This is what we train for. Uh, the Winsor Knight Rescue Wing um, is um, specialized in this capability. Spotting the boat, rescuers boarded, administering first aid to baby Lyra in 24-hour shifts. She is responding to the medication. She is, uh, the rash is going away, and she's, she's just becoming the happy little one-year-old that she is. While there's relief at the news, the decision to have young children at sea has drawn criticism. Even their own family members admit they had concerns from the start. Uh, yeah. Well, when she called me to tell me that she was pregnant with the little one, I said, oh, so the world trip is off, you know? And she said, no, we're still going. And I said, you're crazy. Mother Charlotte responded, blogging, if you can't say anything nice, don't say anything at all. Early this morning, the Kaufmans were likely saying thank you as they left the rebel heart behind and are now safely aboard this U.S. Navy warship, all four said to be in stable condition and heading for home. Robin Stickley, Global News, Washington.